My name is Thomas Lopez Pierre, and I am an affordable housing activist. For 10 years, I have helped people living in homeless shelters and with AIDS find affordable housing. Today, I serve as the executive director of the Harlem Family Eviction Prevention Fund, Incorporated. I am so honored to be a Democratic Party candidate for the 7th New York City Council District, representing parts of the Upper West Side, West Harlem, and Washington Heights in Manhattan. I am a 49-year-old Christian of Dominican, Puerto Rican, and Haitian descent. My ex-wife and I shared three great children, seven-year-old twin girls, Rachel and Christine, and 11-year-old boy, Marcus, who scored all fours on his English, math, and science New York statewide tests. I was born addicted to drugs, abandoned at birth, raised in foster care group homes, and on welfare. Thanks to caring social workers and public school teachers, I attended college, where I started my career as a social justice activist by being arrested for protesting tuition increases at the City University of New York. As a child, my father and I were evicted from our apartment, Stopping landlords from pushing low-income tenants out to make room for higher-income tenants is issue number one in Upper Manhattan. In less than 20 years, the Black and Hispanic population in Upper Manhattan dropped from 90% to 65% due to politicians corrupted with landlord political money weakening tenant protection laws. As your next city council member, I will work hard to pass stronger tenant protection laws, and I will never take political money from landlords. In the Bible, Matthew 6, 24, it says, no one can serve two masters. Either you will hate the one and love the other, or you will be devoted to the one and despise the other. You cannot serve both God and money. Politicians corrupted with landlord political money cannot serve both tenants and landlords.